Hi friends, today I discuss reflection of sound. Sound also bounces back. Sound bounces of a solid or liquid. Solid or liquid like a rubber ball. like a rubber ball bounces of a ball and like sound like light sorry like light sound gets reflected at the surface of solid or liquid and follow the same law of reflection as you have studied for light so the so the law is the first law of reflection is the first law direction in which sound is incident the direction in which sound is incident in incident and is reflected and it reflected make equal angles make equal angles with the normal to reflecting surface with with normal to reflecting surface reflecting surface and the second law is and the second law is the incident sound the second law is incident sound incident reflected and normal all are in same plane all are in same plane so now this is the reflection of sound it same as light reflection of light so the application of sound is echo you hear about echo echo means if you clap near a suitable reflecting object like a, a tall building or mountain we will hear the same sound again and again and again for a little time for a little time so this sound which we hear is called echo which we called echo the sound the sound sorry the sound bounces back bounces back by a reflecting surface by a reflecting surface then back sound or bounces sound it's called echo it's called echo it's called echo the sensation of sound basically the sensation of sound sensation of sound persist in our brain persist in our brain persist in our brain for about 0.1 second for about 0.1 second so the time taken to persist sound time taken to sound back sound in brain is for 0.1 second 
and if i find distance so in the uh, so we take the speed of sound to be 344 meter per second and time taken is 0.1 second then if you find the distance then v equal to d by t so d equal to v into t which is 344 into 0.1 which is equal to 34.4 meter total distance total distance so the sound must go to the obstacle and reach back the ear of listener on reflection after 0.1 second taken 34.4 meter distance so by this observation if i find so by this observation for hearing for hearing distant echo distant echo from the distance echo the minimum distance the minimum distance of the obstacle of the obstacle from the source of sound from the source of sound must be half of this distance means 17.2 meter 17.2 meter this distance will change with the with the, the temperature of air and echo also may be heard more than once due to successive or multiple reflection successive or multiple reflection so more echo more echo or echo should be heard by once more more echo by multiple reflection by multiple reflection by multiple reflection now one new term a new term which i discuss reverberation re reverberation now discuss this term if i discuss on re reverberation then i say a sound a sound created in a big hall created in a big hall will persist by will persist by repeated repeated reflection from the walls from the walls until it is until it is reduced to a value reduced to a value where it is no longer to odd well no longer odd well no longer odd well this repeated the repeated the repeated reflection the repeated reflection that results in this persistence in this persistence of sound is called of sound is called reverberation 
reverberation. So I hope you understand what is reverberation when a sound created in a big hall will persist by repeated reflection from the walls until it is reduced to a value where it is no longer audible. The repeated reflection that results in this persistence of sound is called reverberation. Now if I usage of multiple reflection, if I talk about usage of multiple reflection, use of multiple reflection of sound. First in headphone or in loudspeaker, in loud hailers, second in stethoscope, in stethoscope and many applications and many applications now i discuss on now i discuss or i hope you understand what is the reverberation what is the reflection of sound what is the multiple reflection of sound what is the reverberation so please download the scholar learning app and if you already download this then enjoy learning thanks to watching this video